Hello everyone, it's me Jebby from Inic Tutorials. Today, in this video, I will show you how to get Mac computer like Launchpad in any Windows computer. So, we're in for more delay. Let's begin. So, right now you can see I'm using a Windows 11 operating system on my respective computer. So, if you're using a older Windows operating system like Windows 10 or older than that, still the tricks will remain the same. So, firstly, what you need to do is just open any web browser. And in the Google search, just search for one application name as WinLoans. And on the first list, you will see its official website. Just click on it. Now you can see its official website. And below, you can see your download option. Just click on it to download this software. So wait for a few seconds. So finally, the file has been downloaded. So let me go to the folder where it's being downloaded. And let me close this web browser. So just double click it to run the software installer. Now just click on install wait for a few more seconds. So finally the installation has been completed. Now click on start and wait for a few more seconds. Now click on I accept. Now you can close this. So finally you can see the application has started and you can see almost similar like the Mac computer like Launchpad. So you can get a folders, you can get all the files you can see all the softwares or applications that are arranged on the respective folders so you can see here so if you want to edit you can edit just by right clicking on each of the icons you can edit or you can remove or you can drag and change the positions you can move to another folder also so below you can see here a plus icon on the left bottom just click on it now you will see a tons of options here right the first one is settings next one is to quit that means you can close this launch page and you can add a file by clicking on this add file you can add any respective files you can add a folder as well as you can add a link also and you can add a default apps also and you can see a tutorial also so let us check what are the options available inside the settings so on the first tab that is a general tab you can get a language you can back up your layouts or settings whatever and if you want to make this application run all the time when you turn on your computer then turn on this option and you can see enable touch screen mode also if your computer supports a touch screen then you can enable this option also fill the entire screen if you don't feel like seeing the Windows taskbar, then you can just enable this option. And you can see below, pin win launch to the desktop. You can pin the shortcut to the desktop also. You can block win launch activation when full screen apps are active, Mac portable. So these are the options you will get inside the general tab. And next step is items. So under the items, you will see some clear items. Short items alphabetically, sort only the content of folders and sort folder first. So these are the options you will gonna get inside the items tab. Next to it is a multi monitor. So if you use a dual monitors or triple monitors, so you can use this all option always open wind launch on the active monitor or you can just select your respective monitor if you're using a dual, triple or more than a one monitor. And next to it is a activation. So here are some useful hotkeys or a shortcut keys like you can see the first option hotkey activation enable hotkey so by default shift and tap is set as a shortcut activation for this application so let us try if this really gonna work or not so let me close this and let me try so you can see just press shift and tap to enable or disable this launch pad and the next option is here is a hot corner activations like by default it is being set to the left top corner and if you want to enable all the corners then you can select all this corners also so let me select the left top corner as well as the right top corner and let us check if we're really gonna launch this software or not so let me close this option and now let me try on the left top corner by moving my mouse cursor so you can see it's perfectly working and now let us try by dragging my mouse cursor on the right top corner so it's perfectly working so below there are some more options like middle mouse click activations by double clicking on the middle mouse click 
and below here some more options like enable windows key activations enable control double tap activations enable all tap all double tap activations and again paid activations are also available inside this activation options you can customize depending upon your needs your respective shortcut keys and the next option is the look and feel you can change the columns rows different things you can change the themes you can change the icon size icon shadow so if you just reduce it you can see the icons are decreasing you can increase the icons depending upon your needs and below you will see icon text you can change the text color you can change the icon text shadow color also and next to it is a background you can change the background also you can see enable arrow enable acrylic so whichever you like you can do and you can use a custom background also and the last option here is the interface so you can show extension icons so search bar and the show as indicators so the last one is about the software and about the updates you can check for updates by here and the developer names here so these are the options you are gonna get inside this applications so by using this application name as win launch you can get mac computer like launchpad in any windows computer very easily so if you never known about the school applications which will let you get mac computer like launchpad in any windows computer then you should definitely give it a try so if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching